So we just finished the first dose missions in GTA Online, and now we have the Brickade 6x6 and the Scout C. So now we can set up our Acid Lab, and now we can start making money from the Acid Lab. So without further ado, let's just go make some money from the Acid Lab. All right, so first things first, we need to pay $750,000 to set up the Acid Lab business. So let's just do that, and there we go. Yeah, let's just walk in. He wanted us to walk in. Let's see what we got in here. All right, so here's our Acid Lab right here. Okay, honestly, the guy who's talking right now is pretty annoying is i kind of want to talk right now but he's just kind of talking over me okay so from here we can source manufacture and sell acid to earn additional income call mutt or source supplies from this locations to begin production and get the business up and running once manufactured acid will be stored in this area sell the product for a profit once there is enough stock available and that is what we're going to do in this video today we're going to max this out as quickly as possible and then we're going to just sell it right off and see how much money we make the production speed of your acid can also be boosted at this table once per day okay that's huge because i will do that right now thank you all right so let's modify the acid lab right now equipment upgrade oh okay so i need to complete 10 full again jobs to unlock this for purchase this will increase production speed and the sale value of the acid product okay so that's gonna be big i'm not gonna do that right now though that that's kind of big i already have heavy armor apparently proximity mine oh oh okay i don't know slick mines are kind of funny i'll go slick i'll go slick mines ram weapons oh, okay give me the biggest ram yeah, give me large scoop just without a question oh we can look at libraries okay a lot of people are doing this one i don't want to be like everyone else so i'm just purposely not going to choose that i'm not a huge fan of that i mean i guess i'll go with army camo i don't know it it's not great honestly oh wait oh i kind of like that though i my crew color my sweet crew color kind of changes the game though yeah I, that looks good that looks good all right so this is pretty much my acid lab right now this is this looks pretty nice i'm not gonna lie i kind of like kind of like the look and now i'm gonna customize the delivery bike right here i gotta keep it consistent though i gotta go with the camo i'm gonna go with the camo but then make it the crew because that's kind of what we have going with the brocade i gotta do that you know i'm a fan of consistency all right there we go and that's what my bike looks like after me customizing i honestly don't know how much that costed me in total it might have costed me around like two million i don't know but it looks pretty good i, I will have to say i kind of like it all right so now let's go source some products i guess i am in a public lobby so i am open to getting grief i'm gonna allow that all right so i think this is a good spot all right let's go in we can't source any product from inside the freak shop so i had to drive out of the freak shop so obviously we're outside the freak shop now and let's get to work all right yeah let's source some supplies we're gonna do it on our own we're not gonna use whatever the heck is that guy's name what that's his name so we need to go to dilute them all depot to find some sort of van to then find the location of the product that we need to source so i guess let's go do that you know i'm kind of interested i'm gonna I'm, i feel like this is gonna take a little while my goal is to do these missions on the oppressor because that'll be a little faster traveling from point a to point b and maybe be a little easier to knock out the enemies but i don't know we'll see how it goes oh my god that is so embarrassing i only had like a third of a mile to go are you kidding me jesus and i just i flew right into the cone of vision that's embarrassing all right so i got the locations for the vans so now i'm just gonna have to search the vans see if i can find some supplies okay they're already mad at me i ain't done anything yet i kind of just think i'm threatening which don't blame them all right well i found some supplies what do i do now I, i'm a little lost oh, i gotta lose the cops okay fine all right, I just lost the cops. Now we just got to deliver the supplies to the freak shop. Why don't I just deliver it directly to my acid lab? I, I'm a little lost by that, but whatever. It's fine. Maybe Mutt has to, like, prep it or something. I don't know. I wasn't listening too much. All right, there we go. We just delivered the supplies to the freak shop. All right, there we go. We delivered some supplies. Okay, so what I think needs to happen for this to kind of run as, like, smoothly as possible is, I think, for the brickade just to kind of sit out here... And then we source it from right here. And then we just have an oppressor. And then we just go from point A to point B with our oppressor. So I'm boosting production right now. Hopefully this will go a lot faster. Look at that. Look at that. We have $1,485 worth of value right now. Way to go. All right, there we go. Okay, so let's source some supplies right now. So now we need to go to Dilute them All Depot again. Is this going to be the same mission? I feel like this is like the exact same one. All right, so here we go. So now I'm going to go in my oppressor 
to do this mission. Oh my god, the Little Mall Depot is six miles away. Okay, yeah. This is a lot better than just driving in our brigade. Honestly, right now, other than having the acid lab just in the brigade, I don't know what else the brigade is supposed to do. Because it's not even the vehicle we sell the product in. We sell it on a bike, which that doesn't make a lot of sense. Why can't we just deliver it on the, with the vehicle that we just store it in? But I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't ask questions. I don't know. This this business model is it's a little weird. A little weird. I'm not gonna lie. All right. So we made it to Luda Ball Depot. Uh, yeah. Uh, Jesus. I'm not doing this stealthily at all, which I probably should be doing a little bit better of a job at. All right. So I found the delivery schedule. So let's just steal the delivery schedule. Now we gotta search for the vans. Now where are the where are the vans? Okay. So I found a van right here. Okay. So according according to what this is the van. There's three different vans. And I've found each one first attempt from the looks of it. Oh, I got to lose the cops. Great. I also have to drive it four ways away. So this will, this will be fun. All right. So we just lost the cops again. I'm going to deliver the supplies to the freak shop, which is a far ways away. All right. And there we go. I just delivered the supplies to the freak shop. All right. So for this mission, we have to go to the Grand Sonora Desert. So let's just see what happens. Hopefully this one will be a little bit different. Okay. So we have to go to now a backup drop site. So I got to search the drop site. Oh, there it is. Oh my god. The supplies are on the windmill. Okay. Can I just do something like this? No. Oh, there we go. Okay, now I got it. Because now can I grab it? There we go. Now we just gotta go back to the acid lab and we should be good. All right, and there we go. I just delivered the supplies to the lab, and I think we should be good. I'm just going to keep sourcing supplies until this product bar goes all the way up. I won't, you won't see me until this product bar goes all the way up. So let's fast forward to when we get all the product. All right, it's been a little bit, but as you can see in the bottom right, I have max product. I left my game on overnight, kept buying some supplies here and there, and I finally got the product to be maxed out. It's a new day, so now after all this work, all this time let's just sell off this product and just to let you know before i sell off this product i'm in a pretty full lobby there's 28 people so let's just go sell off this product so so far this is just like a normal um sell mission we just have to get a drop off i mean we're just gonna drop off some of this product all right so we made it to the top floor right here oh we have to stash the asset in this trunk right here okay keep it on the hush hush if you know what i mean ah oh, dear lord oh oh my god Oh my god. Um, this is bad. This is bad. This is so bad. This morning, I watched a video about how to do this, too. That's a stupid thing, and I just did that. I watched someone do this and, like, destroy all the vehicles. All, like, these undercover cops. I was like, oh, there must be undercover cops. And it just did not appear in my mind that I should, that I should take out the undercover cops. Okay, well, now we have to lose the cops. I'm gonna be a little creative. Why? Well, this is probably not creative at all, actually. But... But the subway station is somewhere nearby if I can find it. Okay, well, the cops found me, but I found the subway station. I just wanted to find the subway station. So we're going down. We're going to go down into the... Oh, my God. There's cops in here. No, no, no. Cops, cops. No, cops. Why? Well, dang it. I My foolproof plan is not foolproof. Jeez. Oh, yeah. There's the cop. Yeah. Annoying. All right. So I'm back on my bike. I'm just going to chill out in the metro. All right. So we lost the cops. I have to go back to a different drop-off location. All right. So I made it to another drop-off location. Um, there we go. I delivered it. Now we just have to leave the area. Is that it? Oh dear lord. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, that's an RC vehicle. No, 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 no. 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 This is annoying. This is so annoying. Yeah, what an idiot. Yeah. You know what? That's fine. I'm done anyways. You can bomb me. All I have to do is literally just leave the area right now and this is over. Dude, why is there a jet after me? I'm done. There we go. Okay. Okay. We delivered the product. We got $356,400 from that. And that's without the upgrades too. That was me selling off a full acid lab in GTA Online. Make sure you check out this video right here if you want to see me do all the first dose missions so you do not have to.